हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ रेजिडेंस आज थर्टी फर्स्ट के शिफ्ट वन के पेपर देख रहे हैं मेमोरी बेस्ड पेपर लेट इस सी द क्वेश्चन गिवेन द ऑक्सीडेशन नंबर ऑफ पॉस्फरस इन हाइपोपॉस्फॉरिक एसिड इज हाइपोपॉस्फॉरिक एसिड फॉर्मूला एच फोर पी टू ओ सिक्स इसमें पॉस्फरस की ऑक्सीडेशन नंबर कैलकुलेट करना है फोर इंटू हाइड्रोजन ऑक्सीडेशन नंबर प्लस वन प्लस टू एक्स प्लस सिक्स इंटू माइनस टू इक्वल टू जीरो एंड टू एक्स इक्वल टू माइनस ट्वेल्व प्लस फोर प्लस एट एक्स इक्वल टू प्लस फोर सो आंसर प्लस फोर एंड दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम सरफेस केमिस्ट्री Which of the following micelle structure is obtained when surfactant is added in polar solvent? When surfactant, if you are considering, it has hydrophobic end and hydrophilic end. When the micelle is formed, the colloidal sized micelle is formed by the aggregation of the hydrophobic ends towards the center and hydrophilic ends outside the center. So. the micelle formed can be this one this is from chemical equilibrium for a reversible reaction at temperature 27 degree celsius pressure 180 m pressure so2 plus half o2 is giving so3 kp value is given 7 into 10 power minus 12 The value of Kc is some x into 10 power minus 12. The value of x is. अब इसमें delta Ng value हम calculate कर रहे हैं number of moles of gaseous products minus number of moles of gaseous reactants one minus one plus one by two that is three by two one minus three by two it is minus one by two and Kp Kc relation Kp equal to Kc into RT power delta ng value here you can substitute the data so kp is 7 into 10 power minus 12 and kc into r value 0.082 liter atm mole inverse kelvin inverse and temperature is 300 kelvin and delta ng value is minus 1 by 2 so it is power mein hai delta ng power mein minus 1 by 2 now if you calculate the kc the kc value you will get 34.72 into 10 power minus 12 and if you round off it will be 35 so the x value can be 35 <coughs> the outer electronic configuration of neodymium 2 plus is given as so this is from a block and neodymium is z equal to 60 And its outer configuration is 4f14, 4f4, 6f2, and neodymium 2 plus is 6, 4f4, 6f0. Next, this is the question from periodic table. Identify correct increasing order of size of calcium sulfide, potassium ion, and chloride ion. It is Cl minus ion. So here you can observe calcium potassium and cl minus sulfide sulfide ion and these are all isoelectronic species in the isoelectronic species as the negative charge increases size increases and as the positive charge increases size decreases so among these ions सबसे छोटा है कैल्शियम आयन और उसके बाद पोटेशियम और उसके बाद सी एल माइनस एंड एस माइनस टू सो द करेक्ट इंक्रीजिंग ऑर्डर इज द फर्स्ट वन द इंक्रीजिंग ऑर्डर ऑफ बेसिक स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ ऑक्साइड्स ऑफ एनाडियम वी टू ओ थ्री वी टू ओ फाइव वी टू ओ फोर आर गिवेन इन दिस बेसिक स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ ऑक्साइड इज इनवर्सली प्रपोर्शनल टू ऑक्सीडेशन नंबर ऑफ द एलिमेंट Here oxides V two O three V two O four V two O five oxidation number of vanadium. If you observe, it is plus three in V two O three 
and plus 4 in V2O4 and plus 5 in V2O5. So, among these the less oxidation number is for V2O3. So, it is more basic than V2O4 than V2O5. So, this is the increasing order of basic strength. Next, this is from chemical bonding. The hybridization of XCF4, SF4, and H4 plus and VF3 are respectively. Here, XCF4, if you observe, XCF4 has square planar structure with two lone pair, and SF4 has seesaw shape with one lone pair, and NH4 plus it is tetrahedral shape with zero lone pair, VF3 is trigonal planar shape. Ab isme hybridization hum calculate karenge. So, hybridization is number of lone pairs on central atom plus number of sigma bonds you can calculate. That is for XCF4 it is 4 plus 2 6 that is sp3 d2 hybridization. In SF4 it is number of bonds 4 plus number of lone pair 1 that is 5 sp3 d hybridization and in NH4 plus there is no lone pair 4 sigma bonds. So, it is sp3 hybridization the steric numbers from this we can say the hybridization. In VF3 it is 3. So, steric number is 3 means it is sp2 hybridization. So, the hybridization can be decided based on the steric number. Now, this is a question from simple osmotic pressure question. 2.56 grams of non-electrolyte solute is dissolved in 1 liter of a solution. It has osmotic pressure equal to 4 bar at 300 Kelvin temperature. The molar mass of the compound is. Is may osmotic pressure pi equal to CRT. It is the non-electrolyte. So, Van't Hoff's factor is 4 bar is the osmotic pressure given. Concentration that is nothing but molarity. So, weight by molecular weight into 1 by volume in liters. 1 liter volume is given. So, 2.56 by m into R value it is given 0 0.083 and temperature is 300. Now, on calculating you are getting 15.936 and on rounding off you will get 16. <coughs> this is simple mole concept question 0 0.492 grams of an organic compound and combustion with excess of oxygen give 0 0.792 gram of CO2. Then find the percentage of carbon in the given organic compound. So, 44 grams of carbon dioxide contains 12 grams of carbon and 0 0.792 grams of carbon dioxide contains how much carbon? It is 0 0.792 into 12 by 44. It is equal to 0 0.216 grams of carbon. Now, the percentage of carbon is weight of carbon by weight of organic compound into 100. It is weight of organic carbon is 0 0.216 gram. Weight of organic compound given 0 0.492 into 100. It is 43.9 percent and if you round off it is 44 <coughs> percent. In which of the following reactions hydrogen peroxide acts as reducing agent? So, in the given reactions you can observe Mn2 plus it is oxidized to Mn4 plus. So, here hydrogen peroxide is acting as oxidizing agent and in this HOCl chlorine is having plus 1 state plus 1 oxidation number and here it is converting into minus 1 that means plus 1 to minus 1 it is reducing. So, in this hydrogen peroxide acts as reducing agent and in the Fe2 plus 2, Fe3 plus it is oxidizing. So, hydrogen peroxide acts as oxidizing agent and here PBS it is sulfur is in minus 2 state and it is converting to plus 6 state. That means, minus 2 say plus 6 it is increasing that means 
it is also oxidizing. So, here also hydrogen peroxide acts as oxidizing agent. <coughs> so, in our question, hydrogen peroxide is acting as reducing agent in only second one. This is simple mole concept question. The molar volume of hydrogen gas at STP conditions is 22.7 liter. When 11.5 gram of zinc reacts with concentrated HCl, the volume of hydrogen gas formed is. Here, when zinc reacts with HCl, it is zinc giving zinc chloride and hydrogen. And number of moles of zinc 11.5 by 65.3, this is equal to number of moles of hydrogen only. Now, number of moles of num the volume of hydrogen liberated will be equal to 0 0.16 into 22.7. It is volume of hydrogen peroxide, volume of hydrogen liberated, it is 3.99 liter and if you round off, it will be 4 liter. And here, the molar volume is given as 22.7 liter. Which of the following processes are not used for concentration of ore? Froth flotation, leaching, liquation, electrolysis, hydraulic washing. Among these, hydraulic washing, magnetic separation, froth flotation and leaching. These are the methods used for concentration of the ore. And here, liquation and electrolysis are refining methods, purification methods. These are not concentration methods. So, except these two remaining all are concentration processes. So, answer C and D only not concentration methods. Next one, following values of K are given at different temperatures, find out activation energy. So, here T1 is 200 Kelvin, K1 is 0 0.05 second inverse and T2 is 300 Kelvin, K2 is 0 0.03 second inverse. And we know ln K2 by K1 equal to E by R into 1 by T1 minus 1 by T2, it is Arrhenius equation. In this K2, K1 values are given 0 0.05 by 0 0.03 and these on substitution you are getting E a by 2.303 into 8.314 into 1 by 200 minus 1 by 300 and on calculation you are getting 2.527 kilojoule. Next, what transition in the hydrogen spectrum would have same wavelength as the transition from n equal to 4 to n equal to 2 in helium plus ion? spectrum. Here wavelength of hydrogen and wavelength of helium plus should be same. So, by applying the Rydberg's equation R h into z square into 1 by n 1 square minus 1 by n 2 square. Here for hydrogen z value is 1, for helium z value is 2 and n 1 n 2 values for helium are given 4 and 2. In the Balmer's spec, Balmer's region it is n 1 value is 2 n2 value is 4. Now, it is 1 by n1 square minus 1 by n2 square equal to on calculation it is 4 by 4 minus 4 by 16 and on equating this n1 value is 1 and n2 value is 2 for hydrogen atom. <coughs> Next, this is from again surface chemistry solution colgative. Let storage battery have 38 percent weight by weight H2SO4. Find the temperature at which the liquid of battery will freeze. I value is given and it is Kf. It is the Kf value. Kf of water is 1.86 Kelvin kilogram per mole. And now, Depression in freezing point delta Tf equal to I into Kf into molality and weight of H2SO4 is 38 grams if you consider it as a 100 gram solution and weight of water is 62 gram, molality will be 6.254. And now 
delta T f equal to I into K f into molality and on substitution you are getting 31 delta T f value. But we need freezing point of liquid. So, it is 0 minus T f that can be equal to 0 minus 31, it is 31 degree Celsius. Next one, this is from thermochemistry. The bond enthalpies of Cl Cl bond is given 240 kilojoule per mole, electron gain enthalpy is given minus 350 kilojoule per mole, hydration enthalpy is also given minus 360 kilojoule per mole. Calculate enthalpy of the reaction that is half Cl2 gives Cl minus. Ab isme from born haber cycle half Cl2 say Cl minus iska hum delta H of the reaction find karna hai, standard enthalpy of the reaction ye find karna hai. And isme bond enthalpy given and electron gain enthalpy given, hydration enthalpy is given. So, from born haber cycle it is delta H of the reaction is equal to half into bond dissociation enthalpy plus electron gain enthalpy plus hydration enthalpy. So, on substituting the data you will get minus 590 kilojoule per mole. Next, choose the correct information regarding the products obtained on electrolysis of brine solution. So, brine solution ko electrolysis karne se kya products milega? Brine solution means nothing but dilute NaCl solution, 10 percent NaCl solution and in this, in the aqueous solution Na plus NaCl is ionizing as Na plus and Cl minus. Now, 8 cathode Na plus ions and H2O is also partially ionizing as H plus and OH minus. So, 8 cathode which ions are for competition for discharging Na plus, H plus and water. These are competition at the cathode. But among these, the species which has less deposition potential will deposit easily. So, you can discharge potential is me water ke liye kam hai to ye jildi deposit ho jayegi or H2O mein ye oxygen reduction ok hydrogen gas and OH minus ions produce ho ga. And at anode Cl minus will undergo oxidation and chlorine gas liberate ho ga. So, is mein given options mein chlorine at cathode nahi, chlorine anode ke paas ho ga. O2 at cathode nahi hai and hydrogen at cathode yes and OH minus at anode. No. So, the correct answer is hydrogenate cathode. <coughs> Next, the total pressure of mixture of 0 0.6 grams of gas X molecular weight 20 gram and 0 0.45 grams of gas Y molecular weight 45 grams is 740 mm of Hg. The partial pressure of gas X is, ye to gas is state gas state mein Dalton's law ki problem hai. Ab isme number of moles of gas X 0 0.6 by 20 that equal to 0 0.03. Number of moles of gas Y 0 0.45 by 45 that equal to 0 0.01. And total moles calculate kar rahe hai, 0 0.04 mole. And partial pressure of gas X calculate kar rahe hai, mole fraction into total pressure. It is 0 0.03 by 0 0.04 into 740. This on calculation you will get. 555. Okay. Okay, students. Thank you.